So you walk past AZ900 tomorrow. What do you do? Well, my name's Luke at Cloud Consultant, and I'm going to show you three ways in which you should be able to pass it tomorrow if you start studying now. This here is the learn.microsoft.com platform, and this is the learning path for Azure Fundamentals. This is completely free, given by Microsoft, and you see there's a course here with each unit slash learning path. So within here, you can go in, so it's Describe Cloud Concepts, Architecture, Management and Governance. These are the three learning paths required for AZ900. And then it's got different modules. And if we go in, I'll show you what it looks like. So we go in here. So this is Describe Cloud Computing, Learning Objectives. And then we have the modules part of these learning paths. And this is the chapters. So let's open it up. And you can see it's pretty wordy. So the only downside of this is that it's wordy. But it is comprehensive and it will take about six hours, seven hours to go through. You can just go through, click next, blah, blah, blah. So because I had done this previously, I've then condensed this down into a mind map. Now this mind map, I've created a video on, which is 90 minutes long, so only an hour and a half. And it goes over everything that you need to know to pass AZ900. So you could theoretically watch that video, which is 90 minutes long, length below, and then pass it straight away afterwards. One piece of advice I would have is if you are following along with this, if you have any questions, comments, queries, of course you can let me know below, but I would suggest get a free account on ChatGPT, come in here, and then you can start asking things. So for example, if in this board say you're on Entra ID, maybe you want more explanation on domain controllers. So you're still like, what really is a domain controller? You can just ask ChatGPT, and this is honestly where ChatGPT excels best is to help teach and reaffirm, right? So this here, you can read that, maybe like two or the shorter, and then it will give you, there we go, two sentences, bam. And so you can do that for it. So I'd advise going and watching that 90 minute video, and then once you're done with your 90 minute video, do the practice assessment. This is free, provided by Microsoft. I'll put the link in the description. So I hope this helped. Let me know in the comments below when you're going to take your exam and or if you've passed. Any comments, questions, queries, let me know. I'll talk to you later. Take care.